Hi everyone and welcome to an academy. So let us please on comment box audio and video is clear. Please learners on comment box please. Audio and video is clear. Hi everyone. Good afternoon. So I think learners audio and video is clear and you are most welcome. So Ramlal and then Umid and anyone else, Priyanka, Mishra. So learners, please do join me. Hurry up. Uh, thank you so much, Umid Singh. So learners, audio and video, everything is clear. I'm going to start this wonderful class on foundation codes. So learners, so on this class, I'm going to discuss with you detailed syllabus of UGC NEP. So let us stay tuned with me till the end of the video because let us, this video is really, really important for every UGC net English aspirant. So good afternoon everyone. Please let us jaldi se join kijiye. Phir shuru kiya jaya class ko. Good afternoon everyone. So let us first of all, let me introduce myself. I am A.K.S. Razveer, you are Academy and you are educator. So let us on an Academy, I am teaching you on an Academy Plus. Let us on paid courses and on free courses. So do not forget to follow me on an Academy, the learning application. Then let us uh, would like to inform about my program. So let us my crash course, uh, after my crash course, let us you can see my detailed course that has been already launched. And let us see your crash course. So on this crash course, I am going to cover first four units. Let us first of all, I am going to cover these first four units because let us these four units are really, really important. So let us interested candidate can join my course at an academy plus and use my referral code Razveer Live to get 10% off on your an academy courses. Let us, you can also join me on Telegram. So let us, yes, just search on Google AKS Rasby Telegram and then you will get uh, my Telegram link. So let us now ready to start the class. As on your screen, let us, you can see real syllabus of UGC net in English. So let us, most of the students, most of the students, jo syllabus, let us, usko kaise samasthe? from one, to 10 units from 1 to 10 units so let us 1 to 10 units ke syllabus ko kuch is way mein samajhte hain hamare students like drama poetry prose fiction non fiction part and then let us you can see language in india history future evolution and then let us research method and material in english and uh, cultural studies literary theory literary criticism so let us, these are the units. 1, 2, 10. Our students can understand how to understand. They think that the syllabus that has been provided by UGC NET or let us NTA on its official website. So that is complete one. Let us, that is only a kind of briefing you can say. Only a kind of briefing. Because let us, there is only a topic like prose, poetry, Drama. So let us, uh, if we are going to talk about unit one only. So drama, learners. So drama from uh, ancient time period, or Greek drama, or English drama, or American, or British, uh, or anything else, learners. Yes, you can see or what drama. So konsa drama, learners. We are not sure. Then learners, you have same or on the same way poetry. So, Kansi poetry, English poetry, American poetry, British, uh, let us, uh, British continents or different continents, and war literature. Se. So, not sure and certain. But on this video, learners, I am going to deal with what is the real syllabus of UGC net in English in detail, learners. So, see the first slide on your screen. Let us, we have drama, unit 1 and let us only, the name of that unit is drama. Let us, most of the students totally confused, totally confused and what, what they are thinking ki kaun sa kya padha jaya, kya chhod diya jaya. So first of all learners, 
अगर आप सेल्फ प्रिपरेशन में हैं सो माय सजेशन माय पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू लेनस दीज आर द टॉपिक ब्रीफिंग टॉपिक है लेनस बट मैं डिटेल में डिस्कस करूंगा कि कैसे किन-किन चीजों को इवन लेनस एवरी सिंगल टॉपिक को 1 टू 10 को मैं आपके साथ डिस्कस करने वाला हूं हाय गुड आफ्टरनून राहुल अंसारी रामा देवी शिल्पा जसदीप रामलाल सहनाज मोस्ट वेलकम अंजलि व्हाट्स डू हाय एवरीवन गुड आफ्टरनून सो लेनस सी ड्रामा सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेनस जब हमें पता चलता है वी आर गोइंग टू Learn about only and only drama. So, let us kiss ko cover kiya jaya. This is the biggest question. And I am going to solve this riddle. Ki kaha padna hai, kis ko chhod de na hai, kis ko pakad de na hai. See, let us, uh, first of all, if you are going to cover this unit. So, you must understand, let us, Greco-Roman period. Greco-Roman period. Greek and Roman period. सो ऑन ग्रीको रोमन पीरियड लर्नर्स एक चीज आपको बहुत अच्छे से समझने की जरूरत है व्हाट इज दैट लर्नर्स सो ऑन ग्रीक ट्रेजेडीज यू हैव सीन थ्री मेजर फिगर्स थ्री मेजर फिगर्स आर देयर एक्लीस सोफोक्लीस एंड जूरिपिडीज लर्नर्स दीज आर द थ्री प्लेराइट्स एंड लर्नर्स दे वर द ओरिजिनल ओरिजिनेटर ऑफ ट्रेजेडी फॉर्म so let us uh, first of all you must cover one important play one important play what is the name of that play so let us first of all cover oedipus rex o e d i p u s oedipus rex all learners oedipus the king later on learners what you must cover so learners you have seen in your previous exam in 2019 what was their sonorous orestria trilogy orestria trilogy so most of the students were thinking ki ye question kahan se hai sonorous yes that is also part of greek literature greek literature got it learners and most of the time you will find a question based on oedipus based on oedipus so first of all learners on greek literature you must cover cover oedipus rex later on learners you must remember all the name all the name all the name of those tragedies written by these three figure achilles sophocles and euripides learners so these are the three most important figure from greek time period in drama later on learners on roman uh, literature you can see role of seneca the great tragedy and he initiated revenge tragedy later on learners the concept of revenge tra tragedy that was accepted by uh, william shakespeare john webster and all so learners you must understand about this Ro uh, roman figure seneca and learners uh, menander is also there so these are the most important figure from greco roman time period you must understand that please then see uh, on uh, if we are going to talk about english drama because learners hamara uh, jo major focus hai that is on that is on english drama or english plays so learners first of all we must understand about beginning of the english drama its history and development so learner there must be one introductory class all learners aapko sabse pehle beginning samajhna chahiye from where this drama came so learners first of all beginning of english drama its history its development so is cheez ko learners first of all you must understand later on learners you must cover mystery plays miracle plays morality plays and then learners mystery miracle morality and one more thing learners so that is interlude so learners interlude is also there so you must cover these all four points what are mystery plays what are miracle plays what are morality plays and then later on interlude 
That is the most important important period where drama flourished in its peak. So the time period is Elizabethan time period. Let us if you have any kind of query regarding my class, regarding content or anything, let us so please do write your uh, query on comment box. I am going to reply. Uh, now let us see history and background of Elizabethan theater. Let us yes, uh, during Elizabethan time period, you have seen flourishment of drama. The great dramatists were there. Like William Shakespeare, Christopher Marlowe, Thomas Lodge, John Lilly, George Peel, or Thomas Kidd. Uh, later on, learners, during Jacobian time period, you have seen John Webster is also there. And then, learners, finally, Jacobian and Puritan time period, so you can see a major figure. So, who is he? So, that is, that is, learners, Ben Johnson. Comedy of humor. So, learners, you have to understand this very Got it, learners? So, Elizabethan time period. The best time period, learners, because uh, Shakespeare was there. So, these are the major figure learners. First of all, you must cover from Elizabethan time period, Shakespeare. Then, Christopher Marlowe. Robert Greene is also there. The man who commented on William Shakespeare. Robert Green learners in his Groats of Wit, Groats of Wit. In this particular work, he commented. Thomas Nash is also there. So let us Thomas Nash, unfortunate traveler. Then John Lilly, George Peel, Thomas Kidd, Thomas uh, learners. Then you can see Thomas Lodge, and later on learners, you have seen Webster, Johnson, and other playwright. So, during Elizabethan time period learners, Christopher Marlowe and William Shakespeare, two figures are such that in every bar, which learners you have questions, milne wale hai, at least one question will be there. Okay, just one minute, please. Now let us see, during Elizabethan time period, so these are the major playwright. Let us, if you are interested to, interesting, uh, interested to read these all authors, these all play, playwrights. So let us please do use Google and let us in game name search kare and later on you can see the work written by these authors. Let us not possible to mention every work and everything in a single video. So keep on watching let us. Now see one more thing, so learners, during Jacobian time period. Now you have Jacobian time period. So on Jacobian time period, learners, you can see the playwright like Ben Johnson is there. Ben Johnson is there. Then George Chapman is also there. Beaumont and Fletcher, then Webster, Middleton, Haywood, Decker. So these are the major figures. Even John Marston and all. So these are the figure from which particular time period? So these are the uh, these are the figure from Jacobian time period learners. Jacobian. And later on learners, you have seen Puritan age. So learners on Puritan time period, the major poet of the Puritan age. Who is he? So he is John Milton. And learners at that time, the drama was so very much important. Only a few plays are there. Poetry, epic poetry, so that is Lenin's most important thing. Now, the playwright letters that were working during Jacobian time period, so they were also writing during Puritan time period too. Then let us see restoration or Lenin's, you can say neoclassical time period. Neoclassical time period. So on neoclassical time period, so these are the figures you must cover. Because let us during neoclassical time period, restoration of monarchy, Charles II was restored on English throne. And let us in this time period, you can see comedy of manner, comedy of manner, and one more thing. So, what is that comedy of manner? So, let us another thing, so that is important one, heroic 
plays are also there. Comedy of manner and heroic play. So learners, two kind of writings are there. See learners, so on, uh, uh, you can say learners on uh, restoration comedy or comedy of manner. So you can see these figures like uh, George F. Ruiz is there. Then see learners, Wasserly is there. And then learners, George Farker is there. George Farker is also there. Then Van Brook is also there. Colley, Sibber, Ottaway, Congreve. So learners, these are the major figures from restoration time period. From restoration time period. On heroic plays learners or on comedy of manners, so these all were common authors. Heroic tragedy or heroic plays. So let us that were mostly written by John Dryden, like Conquest of Granada, All Fun Love, or let us other plays by John Dryden. So restoration time period. So let us that is important for comedy of manner. And then let us see. You can see later on let us the work that were written. Uh, after learners uh, neoclassical time period. So during romantic time period, period learners, though drama was written by the authors. Even learners, you can see Wordsworth has also written a play named Bodrer Learners. Bodrer is the play name of the play learners. What is the name of a uh, play written by Wordsworth? So learners, that is the uh, Bodrer is the play. Uh, even learners, agar baat kiya jai, John Keats is also there. Shelley is also there. So let us, these are the these all are the most important figures, and they also try to write play. They also try to uh, write a play, but let us, they were not success. Who zada success nahi be. So romantic time period basically let us for poetry and for criticism two 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 points ke liye let us bahut important. Hai. Now see let us Victorian time period. And during Victorian time period, so learners, two major figure learners I would like to mention here. So one is G.B. Shaw. George Bernard Shaw is there. George Bernard Shaw is there. And George Bernard Shaw, he has written problem plays. And these problem plays were adopted from whom? So these problem plays were adopted from Henrik Ibsen. Let us even William Shakespeare is also known for his problem play writing too. Got it, let us? Yes. So, John Galsworthy is there, G.B. Shaw is there, Henry Ibsen is there, T.S. Eliot in modern time. So, let us, T.S. Eliot, he is famous for reviving poetic play. He is famous for reviving, uh, yes, let us, reviving poetic plays. And C. No Cassie is also there and J. M. Sins learners. So J. M. Sins famous for what learners absurd play writing. Absurd play writing. Ke liye, J. M. Sins aapke famous hai. See learners, so during this time period you have seen the development of drama and mo on modern drama learners you can see problem play, kitchen sink drama and learners yes these all are the kind of plays that were written. So, on Lennon's kitchen sink drama, you have seen a major name. So, that is of John Osborne, Lennon's. Yes, John Osborne is there. Then, Lennon's, you have seen uh, Harold Pinter on uh, Adjured Play. Samuel Beckett is there. Thomas Bird is there. And Noel Coward is there. So, these are the important figures from Adjured Play. Let us basically what I am introducing on this particular class. So let us I am going to introduce from unit 1 to 10 entire learners units and what you must read out of these units. See the learners unit number second. So on unit number second learners what you must cover because learners this is the unit based on poetry. And poetry that is most ancient form of writing. Yes, learners, the oldest form of writing poetry. Even you have seen Mahabharat, Ramayan, Sumerian learners, you have seen epic that is named Gilamesh is there. And then learners, uh, uh, an English epic. So what is the name of that English epic? So Beowulf is there. On poetry learners, so first of all, you must understand origin and development of English poetry 
from old English time period to modern period. From old to modern learners. Old to modern. Uh, yes, sure, Trisha, you can. And learners on English poetry, the most important figure. Learners, kaha se aapki UGC me questions bante hai? So, of course, samaj li na chai. Lennis Geoffrey Chaucer, the most important figure. First of all, Lennis, you have to cover your name. B-E-O, B-O, Wolf. Okay, Lennis? B-O, Wolf, you have to cover your name. Because this is the most important work. Most important work, Lennis, in your UGC net exam, Lennis, three to four times, ask the directly B-O, Wolf, say questions. And questions based on alliterative words. Alliterative words. Okay, learners? Great. Clear hai? Now see learners one more thing. So one more thing is there. So this is this is about Geoffrey Chaucer. So learners, aapko bata hai. Every single exam, there will be a question. There will be a question based on Geoffrey Chaucer. And on his Canterbury tale or his any other work except Canterbury tale. So, let us Geoffrey Chaucer ko aapko zarur karna, cover karna chahi English poetry mein. Then William Langland is there for Piers the Plowman. Okay, let us? Yes. Piers the Plowman. Piers the Plowman is also there. Got it, let us? And then uh, you have seen John Wycliffe. So, John Wycliffe is basically known for his translation of uh, Bible. Ellen is John Gould. He is also there for work like uh, Confessio Amantis. Then it is you have seen Lydgate. So let us, these are the follower of Chaucer letters. Yes, English Chaucerian and Scottish Chaucerian. So let us, English Chaucerian and Scottish Chaucerian is there. So yes, you must understand about these authors in detail and their works in detail. Now let us see wet and sunny. So during Elizabethan time period, you have seen two important figures. Wet and sunny. Let us uh, wet and sunny were prominent figure behind bringing a prominent poetic form of writing. That is learners sonnet. Sonnet ko learners jo lane ka English sonnet jo likne ka kaam hai. वो सबसे पहले विट और शरे नहीं है लेट इस टॉमस टॉमस विट एंड अल ऑफ शरे सो टॉमस विट इटली विजिट किया टॉमस विट ने एंड उनकी मीटिंग पेट्रा के साथ पेट्रा इटालियन सोनेट राइटर और यू कैन से लेट इस इटालियन सोनेट ये सो विट अडॉप्टेड फ्रॉम पेट्रा and from which Share adopted and later on known as other English authors. So as this is what you must understand about songs and sonnet. Elizabethan time period, so known as that is remarkable time period for poetry writing. Poetry and drama known as Bahat peak per likha gaya tha is time period. And you must also understand learn us about metaphysical school of poets. Including John Dunn. Later on, learners, you have seen uh, John Dunn, Henry Vaughan, and Andrew Marvel. So these are all the other important figures associated with what? So these all are the important figures associated with associated with this person. Thank you. Okay, so take uh, learners, please one minute just. Uh, just one minute, please, learners. I'm uh, really sorry for interruption, but learners, uh, uh, going to change my internet connection. Please just wait. Hold on one minute. Oh. Okay, learners. So oh, visible and audible, please. Okay, students.
so let us see on poetry so we were discussing about poetry so let us john dunn is there so you must be uh, uh, understanding about john dunn and then let us abraham kavli is also there let us abraham kavli krasa vogham herbert kayu and sakli so these all are the important figure let us on metaphysical poetry let us because most of the time let us there will be a question based on based on let us uh, metaphysical poetry or cavalier poetry so let us aapko please in dono cheezon ko dono school of poetry ko bahut acche se samajhna zaroor chahiye let us after uh, elizabethan time period we have jacobian and then we have a uh, uh, puritan time period so let us during puritan time period john milton was there and john milton ki writing let us bahut important hai aur unki writing ko zarur aap cover karenge in detail then let us see neo classical time period so on neo classical time period learners you have seen poet like john dryden alexander pope thomas gray oliver goldsmith and learners margaret cavendish and burns and then learners uh, other important poet poet like bishop percy is also there learners so pre romantics are also there okay learners please just deep it's my request please do search these authors not possible to discuss all the works because my works ko bataunga so main ye details syllabus nahi kar paunga students please aise request kare ki jo main kar sakun because learn is not possible in single class so abhi maine unit 2 hi cover kiya hai then 3 4 5 6 7 10 so learn is mai completely cover up karne wala hu now see learn is neo classical type so dryden learn is absolutely my nectophil Alexander Pope so you have seen epic uh, mock epic poetry mock read by Alexander Pope Thomas Gray so elegy written in a country churchyard is there Oliver Goldsmith so let us you have seen uh, Willis and then let us see Margaret Cavendish Burns so Robert Burns so let us is there so these are the most important figure you must cover from neo classical poetry Jonathan Swift is also there he has also written something so learners these are the poetry on romantic poetry learners you have seen different poets so first of all learners you must understand about three major school of poetry three major school of poetry so what are these three major school of poetry one is lake school lake school of poetry another one is learners cockney cockney school of poetry and then let us you have seen satanic school of poets so let us agar aapne inko yaad kar liya so then you are going to cover entire work okay let us yes uh, now see one more thing let us so during romantic time period you have seen different kind of poetic works are there different kinds of poetic works are there like william blake uh, william wordsworth samuel taylor coleridge p b shelley robert savey lord byron and then let us john keats so these are the major poets these are the major poets okay let us and even you have other poets too but let us these are the most important figure from romantic time period every single time in your ugc net exam you are going to find a question i'm going going to find a question based on these particular authors like blake wordsworth coleridge sally shade baron and keats even let us uh, i think aapke most of the time learners in your exam you are going to see then you have victorian poetry so on victorian poetry learners major figure so tennyson is there alfred lord tennyson is there then robert browning learners and then elizabeth barrett browning wife of robert browning let us please do a screenshot kar le aap please learners so aap easily sab kuch cover kar sake please it's my request students uh, now let us see uh, one thing so elizabeth barrett browning then let us you have seen john clare is there matthew arnold is there christina rossetti 
So let us pre Raphaelite poetry. And then let us R. L. Stevenson is there, Oscar Wilde is there, W. B. Yeats, Kipling, and Thomas Hardy and John Hopkins. So let us, these are the most important figure learners. Jinki poetry aapko samajne ki bohat zarurat hai learners. It's my request. Always let us focus on these poetry writer or these poets learners. So aapka exam jo hai bohat easy ho jayega. Because learners aapko sirf ye pata hai na only ki UGC net have a, a, a unit learners only and only named poetry. So let us agar only and only named poetry hai. So I think let us ye thik wali baat nahi, better wali baat nahi hai. Now see learners pre raphaelite brotherhood. So iske baare mein bilkul bhi nahi. Victorian time period learners, so on Victorian poetry, you are going to see the clash between religion and science. Clash between religion and science. So that can be seen in Elizabeth, uh, Eliz uh, sorry, Victorian time period poetry. Browning learners, so he is known for optimistic writing. And learners, you have seen uh, Thomas Hardy, so he is known for pessimistic writing. Got it learners, so ye figure aapko cover karne hai, these are the names. Now see learners, modern poets and modern poetry learners or modern age. So major figure from this particular time period. So learners, first of all, you must understand about T.S. Eliot, Thomas Eastern Eliot. On drama learners, so he was important figure because learners, he initiated poetic play in English. Revived, yes, learners, revived poetry, poetic plays. And then, uh, uh, learners, you can see Eliot, and then you have seen Pound. So, learners, Pound is known for his symbolism. Yes, learners, he is known for his symbolism, images. So, learners, two major figures, learners, Pound for his uh, images, and then, learners, you have seen. Uh, uh, William Butler Yeats, let us. William Butler Yeats. William Butler Yeats, let us. So he is known for his symbolic poetry, let us. Symbolism. Okay, let us. So symbolism for William Butler Yeats and let us. Imagism for Ezra Pound. So let us. Yeah, you have to know this. And you have to know this. And you have to know this. And T.S. Eliot, so let us like Wasteland, As Witness Day. Portrait of a Lady, so learners, these are the most important poem. And then you have Alfred Lord Prefog, J. Alfred Prefog, learners. A love song of J. Alfred Prefog. And then you have seen uh, uh, Dylan Thomas, learners. So Dylan Thomas's poetry, so learners, you can see. And Stevenson's poetry. Auden group, learners. So Auden group, you have seen the major figure, learners, like Lewis Magnus is also there with Auden group. Okay, learners. So, Auden group learners, that is also known as 1930s group. So, learners, please, Auden group ki poetry ko zarur padi. Auden group poetry learners, that is also known as Max Poundy and all. Then, see, learners, war poetry is there. On war poetry, Wilfred Owen, Siegfried Sassoon, and then, learners, you have seen other figures like Thomas. Hardy is there, so these are the most important uh, poet. Ki jin logo ne learners war poetry ke baare mein discussion kiya. Then learners William Carlos Williams, Ren Maria, Rilke and Arthur Rimbaud. So these are the most important figure. Later on learners you have seen other poet. Uh, on world literature learners aap keh sakte ki world literature mein like Richard Wright from Australia. And then learners on Indian writing, we have dictated different poets. So modern time period and post-modern time period poetry cover up karna bohat important hoga students aap sabke liye. And now see learners about fiction parts. So what is there on fiction part learners? What is there on fiction part? So first of all learners see the historical development of fiction. Historical development of fiction as a genre. So first of all, learners, you have fiction part me ye cover karna hai. This is learners unit three. And on unit three, learners, so first of all, you must understand historical development of fiction. 
Thomas Nash is there, so Lunas Usne is stuck ki unfortunate traveler ke sa. Utopia is there, Lunas, so that is by Thomas Moore. Thomas Moore is Utopia. Uh, and Lunas, Miguel de Cavantes. So Miguel de Cavantes, so what, what, what he has written, so Lunas, Don Quixote is there. On fiction part, Lunas. Daniel Defoe is there. <laughs> so Lunas, Daniel Defoe, so he has written... Robinson Crusoe. Then let us you have John Bunyan for Pilgrim's Progress. And then Thomas Mallory is also there. So Thomas Mallory, he has written Mote D. Arthur. So let us, these are the, these are the, let us, earlier work on fiction genre. But the proper beginning of a novel, the proper beginning of fiction can be traced back. Let us with Richardson, the novel has so thoda sapne form there. Richardson, Fielding, Stern and Smollett. So let us four wheels of novel. So let us goldsmith ko cut kar dijiye. But see Richardson, Fielding, Stern. And Smollett. So these are known as the just learners. These are known as what? So learners, these are known as four wheels of novel. Let us like seven university wits. You have seen four wheels of novel. So learners, in ke works ko cover up karna bahut zaroori. Later on, learners, aapko bata na chahiye ki jo novel ki proper beginning hai. So that started in 18th century. Got it, learners? 18th century mein beginning mein. And on 18th century, learners, ye shari chizhe aapne dekh liya. And now, see, learners, 19th century. 19th century, so learners, it means romantic time period. It means romantic time period. Romantic time period mein, learners, aapke paas hai, Walter Scott. Walter Scott is there. Hathorn is there. Then George Meredith, Jan Austin, Walter Scott, Horace Walpole learners for Gothic writing. Walter Scott, so learners, you must know about Walter Scott, historical novelist. And then learners see Jan Austin, so domestic novel. Then Anne Bradcliffe, so learners, yes, you, uh, Gothic novel. William Beckford, Gothic novel. Matthew Gregory Lewis, so learners for Gothic novel, Mary Shelley for Gothic writing, Frankenstein, and Maria Edwards, so learners for historical novel writing, and then as Thomas Lapicock, so he has written romance and all. So these are the important figures, important novelists from 19th century. And you must cover every single novelist. Now see learners, during Victorian time period, so learners, this was the time period where novel flourished in its full form, in its complete form. So during Victorian time period, during Victorian time period learners, you can see Charles Dickens was there, so he has written wonderful work learners. His protagonist, his writing and his characterization Learners, marvelous, outstanding. Then Thackeray is this, learners. William Mathis Thackeray. So, learners, Thackeray is writing. Most of the time, learners, Thackeray is going to discuss about upper class society. Upper class society, learners. Yes, Mathis Thackeray. So, Charles Dickens, learners, he was interested in poor class. But Thackeray was interested in upper class society. And then, learners, you have seen Bronte sisters. Emily Bronte, Charlotte Bronte, and then, learners, in Bronte, Emily Bronte, and Charlotte Bronte. So, learners, you have to that Bronte sisters are there, and Emily and Charlotte Bronte. And then, learners, you have seen Elizabeth Gaskin, Anthony Trollope, and then George Eliot, Thomas Hardy, George Gissing. And William Morris, Wilkie, and learners, you have seen Wilkie, and then Collins, Wiki Collins. Got it, learners? And then 
H. G. Wells. So these are the most, most, and most important figure from Victorian time period. Thomas Hardy Lennis. So Thomas Hardy, he is going to discuss all about the life of his struggle. Life of his struggle, Lennis. Yes, very important, Lennis, and he is going to depict pacifism. Lennis on realism and naturalism. So Lennis, two, three figures are there. So Lennis, you have seen Henry Ibsen, G. B. Shaw. And then John Galsworthy. So, Lennis, John Galsworthy is also there. Jessica, sir, good evening. But as I was doing, was not able to develop command on question and solve the. Uh, just please, Jessica, go uh, go through with notes and cover. Try to cover every single important topic so then you easily can find it. Yeah, बिल्कुल simple answer है आपके लिए Jessica. Then see, learners, modern and postmodern novelist. James Joyce, then Henry James, Joseph Conrad, Dorothy Richardson, D. H. Lawrence, and Virginia Woolf, E. M. Foster, Galsworthy, H. G. Wells, Rudyard Kipling, George Orwell, Evelyn Vaughan, then Aldous Huxley, and then let us you have seen uh, Samuel Beckett is there, jo uh, Graham Greene is there, and then. Conrad, so known as Joseph Conrad, and then Evelyn Vaughan, and Tony Powell, Kingsley, Amis, and then let us see William Golding, Iris Mitro, Muriel Spark, and Tony Burgess, Joris Lashing, Salman Rushdie, and then V. S. Nakal, George Lamming, Isiguru, and then Carter, Margaret Drabble, A. S. Bratt, Martin Amis, Ian McEwan. And then Linus, you have seen William Somerset Maugham and then Agatha Christie. So these are the most important figure from postmodern novelist and modern novelist. So Linus, in authors ko aapko cover karna hai on novel part. Linus, this is the complete list Linus on your screen. So please do a screenshot. Agar aap isko a screenshot kar lenge, so then you will come to know ki novel mein hume कौन कौन से ऑथर को कवर अप करना है सो दिस इज द कंप्लीट लिस्ट लर्नर्स ऑन योर स्क्रीन सो प्लीज एक बार आप स्क्रीनशॉट कर ले लर्नर्स एंड द सोर्स ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर लर्नर्स ये स्लाइड इज विकिपीडिया लर्नर्स बिकॉज़ वहां से मैंने डायरेक्टली कॉपी किया कि मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट ऑथर्स कौन कौन से होंगे जिनको हमारे स्टूडेंट्स को पढ़ना चाहिए इवन लर्नर्स मैंने कुछ ऐड भी किए हैं ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर पार्ट and then see let us non fictional prose non fictional prose so let us on non fictional prose you are going to study about letters about uh, essays about biographies memoirs and then you have journals and uh, different kind of historical technical and then travel books so let us bahut kuch cheeze aap cover karne wale hain on non fiction part so first of all learners non fictional part jisko aap samajhte hain learners so that is start from with vacans ac non fictional work so let us like translation of a bible non fictional work learners any kind of track like driver stacked by milton Aeropagitica by Milton. So, let us that is known as non-fictional work. So, different kind of learners travel books, short stories, journals, memoirs, and magazines. So, learners, these are the part of you can say easily learners, part of non-fictional prose. So, on non-fictional prose learners, start from very first learners. It start from Middle English time period. Then uh, you have seen Renaissance, Neoclassical, later on Romantic, and then learners you can see Victorian, Modern, and Postmodern. How to cover learners non-fictional work? Basically, learners, एक चीज मैं यहाँ पर deal करना चाहूँगा आपसे. जब भी आप पढ़ते हैं, so please never divide literature, fiction, non-fiction, this one, that one. Just try to read all the important pages that are on your books. Why learners? Because learners, if you prose, poetry, drama, fiction, and non-fiction, if you are different, then there will be a lot of problems. Even if you don't understand the ages. Okay, learners, so please try to understand everything 
विद हिस्ट्री हिस्ट्री ऑफ इंग्लिश लिटरेचर के साथ सब कुछ कवर करें During romantic time period learners, you have seen a lot of journals out there. During neoclassical time period, during 18th century learners, so what you have seen periodical essays are there by Edison, Steele, then Johnson, Oliver Goldsmith. So periodical essays are there. So learners, these are the source of non-fictional prose. Got it, learners? So political writing, journalism, and all. Now see the learners unit five fifth and this is language basic concept theories pedagogy and English in use. So learners see first of all on this particular part learners you have seen different kind of method of teaching language like learners direct method GTM grammar translation method ALM so learners this is audio lingual method. A structural approach and then let us you have physical response TPR total physical response communicative language teaching silent way task based learning natural approach lexical approach so these are the important topics you must cover on unit fifth but let us map with other paper out question class let us please go with I got question class and what आपके एग्जाम में लेनर्स लैंग्वेज बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट थियरीज एंड पैडगोजी इंग्लिश इन यूज सो क्वेश्चन कहां से आने वाला प्लीज लेनर्स डू राइट योर आंसर ऑन कमेंट बॉक्स प्लीज क्वेश्चन कहां से आने वाला है जल्दी से So learners, please try to understand there will be a question from GTM, Grammar Translation Method. Most of the time learners, GTM, Audio Lingual se bhi aata learners, TPR se bhi aata, Total Physical Response se bhi, and other, uh, other se bhi learners, but please GTM most important, hai. GTM, Grammar Translation Method. Then learners, you have see, you can see Unit 6. So this is English in India, history, evolution, and future. So first of all, so first of all, let us there will be introduction part. So introduction of English language in India. Then 1813 Act, so known as 1813 Act, so that is known as Charter Act. Charter Act. Then known as General Committee of Public Instruction, so 1823. Then Lord Macaulay and his education policy, so that is 1835 with Macaulay Minute. Woods Dispatch, so learners, Charles Woods Dispatch, so that, that is uh, known as Woods Dispatch, learners, yes, 1854, and then Hunter Commission, so 1882 to 1883, Sadler Commission, and then Indian English Literature, History and Development, and Indian Writer. So learners, yes, so you Indian Literature, but you can cover a remaining learners, so yes, 1813 to 1917, 1919. So please learners in Sadi points go remember. And then see learners, you have, you can see the next one unit. So this is cultural studies. And learners, cultural studies are most of the students totally, totally and totally confused. On cultural studies learners, you are going to study about uh, a structural development of cultural studies. So, from where it is started and how it is it, it started, and what are the reasons behind cultural studies. Then, let us first of all try to understand the theories and methodologies, then issue and all, and Marxist theory. Marxist theory, so learners that plays prominent role, like Antonio Gramsci is there, Raymond Williams is there. Then Richard Bogart is there, Stuart Hall is there. So these all are the major figure learners, you can say major figure. And then learners, after these all figures, you can see the more important figure, like uh, uh, you, you, you can see learners uh, on Marxist theory, feminist theory, race and culture theory. So uh, everything is there, learners. 
and then let us try to understand globalization media culture mass culture culture of uh, let us higher culture low culture so let us these are the important point you must focus on and let us on cultural con con consumption so you can see let us so what is there so on cultural consumption let us aap bahut sari different cheezon ko dekh sakte hain so on cultural consumption learners you can see different kinds of consumption theories are there different kinds of consumption theories are there got it learners so these uh, these theories let us plays a prominent role on cultural studies then let us see the concept of text concept of text टेक्स्ट के साथ कैसे लर्नर्स आइडियोलॉजीज एंड ऑल जोड़ी जाती है सो प्लीज यू मस्ट फोकस ऑन दैट एंड देन प्रोमिनेंट कल्चरल थियोरिस्ट लाइक स्टुअर्ट हॉल रामन विलियम एंटोनियो ग्रामसी एंड देन लर्नर्स अदर फिगर लाइक लाइक लर्नर्स यू कैन सी फिस्क इज देयर एंजेला मैक रॉबी इज देयर सो दीस आर द इंपॉर्टेंट फिगर इन कल्चरल स्टडी Then let us literary criticism. So let us most of the students, I think, let us all go clear. Hoga from where to cover literary criticism. So let us literary criticism. You can cover from Plato to let us you can say from 19th and 20th century. So uh, classical criticism is is there and contemporary criticism is there. Criticism ke part me let us bilkul confusion nahi hona chahiye. Plato. Aristotle, then Sidney, Stephen Goshon, later on learners, आप Dryden को देखें, Dryden के साथ साथ, then Johnson, theory of humour, and then learners, Pope is there, then on romantic time period learners, you can see Hazley, Hunt, De Quincey, Wordsworth, Coleridge, and even learners, uh, uh, Charles Lamb is there. So these are the most important figure. and learners on uh, uh, on learners victorian time period so you have seen mature non yes horus longinus yes bilkul right omed so horus longinus ko learners aapko cover up karna chahiye and then learners later on after covering these all important figure on modern time period so learners t s eliot most important figure learners who is he so he is t s eliot So, learners, आपको टीएस एलियट को कवर करने की जरूरत है एफ आर लेविस डेलनेस फॉर डीकंस्ट्रक्शन सो आप न्यू थियोरीज और जो लर्नर्स आपका लिटरेरी क्रिटिसिज्म है कंबाइंड इसको जरूर कवर करें लर्नर्स ये दो आपकी जो यूनिट्स हैं वन लर्नर्स सो दिस इज यूनिट ए लिटरेरी क्रिटिसिज्म दैट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज क्लासिकल क्रिटिसिज्म and literary theory so let us on literary theory you have seen different kind of theory formalism psychoanalytic marxism then reader response structuralism post structuralism new historicism post colonial theory feminist criticism gender critical race and then see eco criticism is also there and then let us uh, uh, other theories uh, are also there okay let us like queer theory and all so these are these all are the literary theory you must cover and finally learners you have unit 10 this is unit research method and material in english so on research method and material in in english what you must cover so learners mujhe lagta hai ki ye jo topic like research introduction research types research methods and research tools So, learners, आपने ये सारी चीजें आपने पढ़ा है पेपर वन में पेपर वन में सो लर्नर्स पेपर वन एंड पेपर टू सेम बट लर्नर्स फ्यू थिंग्स डिफरेंट है लाइक like, लर्नर्स अगर देखा था यहाँ पर सो राइटिंग रिसर्च पेपर सो रिसर्च पेपर का पैटर्न क्या है उसको समझने की जरूरत है लर्नर्स रिसर्च पेपर बड़ा राइटिंग ऑफ रिसर्च पेपर पैटर्न थीसिस लर्नर्स बुक्स स्ट्रक्चर क्या है इसको समझने के लिए आपको जरूरत पड़ेगी एंड वन मोर थिंग लर्नर्स रिसर्च मैथड एंड मेटीरियल इन इंग्लिश सो लर्नर्स रिसर्च मैथड एंड मेटीरियल सो लर्नर्स लिंग्विस्टिक रिसर्च इज देयर एंड लर्नर्स लिटरेरी रिसर्च इज देयर टू टाइप्स ऑफ रिसर्च आर देयर लिंग्विस्टिक एंड लिटरेरी रिसर्च 
सो लिंग्विस्टिक को भी कवर करना है लर्नर्स एंड लिटरेरी रिसर्च टू लर्नर्स सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट टेन यूनिट फ्रॉम वन टू टेन लर्नर्स की जिनको आप कवर करके या सेल्फ प्रिपरेशन में हो या फिर आप किसी इंस्टीट्यूट में आपने ज्वाइन किया हो लर्नर्स तो प्लीज इट्स माई रिक्वेस्ट डू कवर दीज ऑल इंपॉर्टेंट ऑथर Learners in my one hour class, I am not able to cover the entire syllabus, entire works, entire name of the authors, entire theories. But learners, a few highlighted point, मैंने जो आपको show करने की कोशिश की है, that you can understand easily. So please learners, if you have any kind of query, so do write on comment box, learners, and I am going to reply. So please learners, if you have any kind of query, so please let me know. Hurry up, learners! On comment box, do write. Please, learners, do write your queries on comment box. If you have any kind of query, so please, learners, do write. ओके लर्नर्स शो थैंक यू सो मच आप इस क्लास में आए और लेटर ऑन भी लर्नर्स आते रहे आपको बहुत कुछ सीखने को मिलता रहेगा मेरे साथ यानी एक इस राजवीर के साथ एंड लर्नर्स कीप ऑन वॉचिंग कीप ऑन लर्निंग एंड लर्नर्स ये जो सिलेबस है बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग सिलेबस को अगर आपने डिवाइड कर लिया सो आपको पढ़ने का मजा आ जाएगा प्लीज लर्नर्स आई नो वेरी बिल तभी आपको मजा आएगा आयशा शेक्सपियर ऑन रूट लेस बट इट्स नॉट कंप्लीट जेसिका शेक्सपियर जैसे ऑथर्स कहीं कंप्लीट नहीं हो सकते प्लीज सो यू कैन टेक हेल्प हेल्प ऑफ गूगल जेसिका और एनी अदर बुक प्लीज यू मे विजय मतेश शो आई थिंक ऑन माई नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट बुक्स फॉर प्रिपरेशन यूजीसी ने Okay, I have already discussed uh, books and material and all. Okay, learners. So bye. Take care of yourself, learners. Next class, me, me, फिर से मिलूँगा. तब तक के लिए नमस्कार. And learners, if you are interested on in my courses, so learners, yes, you can subscribe to An Academy Plus. Use my referral code that is a Razveer Live and get ten percent off on your courses. And learners, me, सब कुछ from Unit One to Ten cover कर दूँगा. Jessica and what to do for wolf and others Jessica on my previous class i have already told about books so please refer those books and take help of internet google eight nine ko combine this liye bola jata hai kyunki dekhiye literary criticism so literary criticism that is known as classical criticism from from plato to eliot From Plato to Eliot. 